Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to John R. Nelson Gymnasium. This is Culver TV, brought to you by RTC TV4, along with Chris Stevens and Colton Miller. I'm Mike Bushman, bringing you the opening game of the 2019 season for both your Culver Cavaliers and the visiting Rochester Zebras. These teams facing off in their traditional Wednesday before Thanksgiving basketball game. Coach and I were talking about this earlier in the week. We're really not sure how long this has gone on, but as long as either one of us can remember, this is one of those uh, tried and true hallmarks of the winter sports season, I'm sure, up at the, down in Zebraland as well, but up here in Culver, this is one of those things that lets us know winter sports are underway. Get this Culver versus Rochester game going. Uh, front of a lopsided affair last year. Cavs were down a bit, so hoping to see a little bit more of a competitive contest. Your boy Cavaliers under direction of new head coach James Hafley. So things have been kind of shaken up here in Cav land. The, uh, the boys are going to try out the new offenses and defense and so forth. I know I've walked to the gym a few times. I know they're working hard, trying to get better, trying to take in the philosophies the coaches working through. And we'll see what kind of product we have to put out there on the floor. Yep. Coach Hafley coming in from Howell Military that shut their doors last year. Also serving Culver as a Rochester health teacher for, uh, for Culver in the middle school, the middle school. so this will uh, be his maiden voyage by here. Again, the Cavs are without it for the program. season the um, Your for services of Tucker Fisher, Fisher, who blew his knee out Kerr, in football. Other than that, uh, returning Owen Valaquet, Hunter Manns, Owen Klinger, Donovan Ziaja, from the varsity lineup, I believe that's everybody varsity-wise who they're returning. Um, Braxton, Conley, Josh Havron, both moving up, getting some time from the JV, which they predominantly did last year. Um, Jalen King also. Jalen King, yeah, I saw Jalen King out there, but he's been putting in some varsity minutes today. He'll be a, pre yeah, he'll be a predominantly varsity player, yeah, I think so, varsity player, especially I as, I think as the season that's, moves on. Yeah, that, that's a good point. Probably have a lesser role in that's the JV. That's a good point. Yeah, Pardon see, me, in the JV. Yeah, that's, that's a good point. Um, so they're going to get uh, about 40 seconds away from opening festivities here with lineups and anthem and so forth. <laughs> Colonel <laughs> Justin Croy will be on the mic for those. Rochester uh, under the uh, leadership of Rob Malco and uh, Tony Stasiak. Uh, I believe it's Mal this is Malco's uh, third, third year. Yep. Of course, Stasiak's been coaching at Rochester forever. Uh, girls girls side mostly but I see there's a couple Stasiaks on the uh yeah on loaded, the roster. With, loaded with juniors and seniors here too okay the clock's ticking down we'll send this over to Mr. Croy ladies and gentlemen would you please rise and gentlemen remove your caps as we honor America with the play of our national anthem Tonight's season opening game. 
And now first for the starting lineups for the Rochester Zebras. Number two, Quinn Stasiak. Number five, Nicholas Allen. Number 11, Kyle Reinhardt. Number 24, Cavalry Lingenfelter. And number 32, Blake Hughes. The Zebras are coached by Rob Malco. Mr. Croy yeah, on that Mr. one. That's, Croy, that's uh, Coach got James the, Hayfley. Hayfley. It's a Hayfley. Long A there. Yeah. Okay, so we'll roll out for the tip off here. Donovan jumping off here against 32 years is Blake Hughes. Is that? Well, yeah. That was a 32. Tip goes to the Cavaliers. Clinger over to Manns. Donovan centers it. Back to Braxton. Rochester in man to man. Donovan. Looks like they're going to try a little trapping out of that. Finds his way out. Picks up his dribble. Over to Owen. Three point basket is. Oh, in and out. Rebound by Stasiak. Coming up the floor here. No foul there on Owen Klinger. Cavalier foul number 10, Owen Klinger. This first team first. Allen shoots a three, off the rim, rebound. Oh, blocked there by Braxton. I think we had an out of bounds there, yep. Oh, he traveled. Same difference. Turnover. Ju judging from the scrimmage and it's and the first shot here, one of the things we have to really work on is boxing out. Not merely getting in front of the guy, but getting a butt in and controlling the space. Three point shot, off the rim again. Once again, offensive rebound. Rebound by Reinhardt's. Another foul shooting foul here. Cavalier foul number 11, Donovan. Ryan, it's shooting two. His first, team second. And as you say, Coach, we've got to get a body into them and, and own the space, not just be in front. Positioning's not bad. Just yeah. got to have to actually drive them back. Yep, yeah, drive them back. Right now, Santa line for the Zebras. Misses in the first, we'll have one more. And yeah, first points on the board there. Rochester draws first blood. Got the press Pressure. on. Pressure. Oh. Turnover Cavaliers. A little too much pepper on it. Braxton can't handle it. I believe that's second turnover. Yep. Now we'll trigger the inbound pass again. So 
So he just screens, not seeing what he likes. Allen with the ball back. Stasiak goes inside. No shot. And call a foul on the floor there. Hunter Mans picks up his first Cavs, creeping toward foul trouble here early in the game. Just a minute in, we've already picked up three on three different players. Good hands there, make things difficult. Tapped again. Hunter comes up at this time. He's going to let things clear out. We ball the floor. Trapping. Donovan back into Hunter. Out to Owen. Had a look. Didn't want it. Again, picks strong. up his dribble in a bad spot, but picks up the foul. Good job being strong with the ball there by Owen Balaquet. Coach Deziak telling him you don't have to reach there. Yep. Yeah, they had it. Panic was ensuing. Yeah, absolutely. Long pass to Owen. Braxton dribbles across to Donovan. They're going to be trapping everything in yep. the corners. Right off Donovan's leg, yeah. Donovan's not liking the call, but from up here it looked like it rolled right off his leg. Pull up by Stasiak, no good. So. Considering a okay, yeah. couple turnovers and a couple offensive rebounds we've given up, we're still yeah. sitting all right. Take a deep breath, calm down, handle that trap, we'll be okay. Uh, Got to watch those. Good cut. Owen was there. He's gonna have to Unforced cut. turnovers. Oh. That's going to be a. I thought that might have been a push off there on Ziaja. We'll take it though. That that we got a little more movement. That everybody kind of got to their spot and stood there. Balakut brings it to the top. Good pressure by the uh, Zebras Absolutely. out on the perimeter. You know that's coming. Yeah, that's something, though, where it's Hughes's layup is missed. I have a jump ball here. That's something where if you can get your offense to run okay, then people get tired a lot faster when the offense works with pressure like that. Yarber checks in the game. So the two six five guys swap in and out. That's a nice little. That's a nice little tool to have. And the fellow down to Allen. Reinerts is going to shoot two more. It's going to be two on Klinger. Cavalier foul number ten. Owen Klinger, his second team score. Coach Malco probably barking out what's going to be a, some full court pressure here, I would assume. Yep. Again, as, as if you've paid any attention over the last couple seasons to our broadcast of Cavalier basketball, tried and true thing if you want to get at the Cavaliers, full court pressure. It's, it's something that doesn't matter to the coach. It doesn't matter the, the year. It's tough for guys to handle, gals to handle in our, in our programs. I don't really know what that's about. Mr. Silva is not taking his warm-up jersey off. Well, you know, he is a, an exchange yeah. student from yeah. Brazil. This is his first United, uh, you know, United mm -hmm. States <coughs> organized basketball game, so he's gonna. Well, and I think he seems super excited to get out sure. there. So, super nice kid. That's good. That's good. Seems like it. I haven't had a chance to talk to him much. He's not in any of my classes, so. I think we've got a technical foul here for the running onto the floor. They're not gonna they're not gonna forget the language barrier here. Gotta play by the rules. Uh, 
Uh, I'm not quite sure what's going on. I'm not sure either. He said it'll be your ball. It'll be your ball. So I'm not. I'm not sure what's going on here. Ah. Hmm. Uh, I maybe had somebody not written down that they tried checking in the game. Book error. Yep. Okay. Under man's puts the Cavaliers on the board. First, uh, first game jitters on both sides, yeah. I guess. Yeah. Get in there. There we go. Cavs take the lead. Entering the game for the Cavaliers, number 25, Richard Da Silva. Donovan trapped. Got to keep that thing moving, guys. Hunter takes it in. Doesn't like it. Yep, we got to be ready. We got to expect that trap. Be ready to pass fake. And there's going to be somebody open because they're all flooding. Here comes Owen. Layup is good. Owen Balakwe puts one in. Allen drives. Shot to Stasiak. Lingenfeller shoots. Three point basket's good. I like that. It's tied right back up. Three point basket. Calvary. Lingenfelter. Silva in the man's. Braxton over to Richard. Allen gets it to Valaquet. There we go, got good. a little foul there. Good little pass fake yeah, just move keep there, buddy. Just, yep. just do things with confidence and keep moving, and it'll be fine. Lots of pass fakes. Foul to number 40, Low center Jordan. of gravity and ball and triple threat. Rip it through, be just fine. And in addition, they're going to run out of gas quick. Well, they are. Subbing in and out, platooning, yeah. The you get Trey Stasiak checking into the game. Again, they're loaded juniors and seniors, so I'm sure they all know what the heck's going on in this program. Donovan goes over top, bang, it's five second call. Cavaliers, Just a second Cavaliers gonna have to polish up the out of bounds yep. plays. Yep, indeed. It's always been a pet peeve of mine, out of bounds plays. Yeah. And Felter. Pass goes out to Stasiak, shoots a three, rims out. Again, nearly an offensive rebound, but we're going to get a foul instead. Good sportsmanship yeah, there. Absolutely. Cavalier and a zebra both helping up the zebra. Reinhardt picks up his first. Here we got some full court pressure by the zebras. Yep. Oh, don't dribble backwards. What do you, no palms up, Hunter. Yeah, we got to get right back to playing. We're calling her over and back. Over and back. Over yeah, I think he jumped from the backside, caught it before he landed. Is that what they're going to call here? Over and back. I was watching. Uh, yeah, so I was watching Hunter. I didn't. So I, said I two. didn't see what happened, but I believe he was just on this side of the half court line and caught it in air. And doesn't matter. The call's going to stand and go back to Cavaliers. Get another shot at this. Be strong with it. Be firm. Be confident. And keep moving. Good. There we go. Oh. Lingenfelter's going to get it out. Stasiak looks inside. Lingenfelter pump fakes. Almost loses the handle. Let's go hands up, guys. Stasiak looks inside. Stolen by Hunter. Man slows it down. Gets back to Donovan. Nearly travels, nearly loses the handle, and then he does. He got his pocket picked. Yeah, Donovan just needs to take his vo his velocity down just a touch. He's trying to do just a little too much, too fast. He's in good positions, just, again, you, you call that. It seems a little first game jitters here. We need to just take a deep breath and. Let the game come to him. Yep. Push off. Yep. 
Foul's going to be on Mans. That'll be his second. Hmm. Lincoln Felter brings it into the front court. Stasiak off the air ball there, picked up by De Silva. Don't let him get set up. Now we got four people right there. That means there's a whole lot of white jerseys open, fellas. We call time out here, Coach. Yep. Coach Hafley is going to talk it over a little bit, try to get this trap stuff sorted out for our boys. We'll take a timeout with him. This is Culver TV, brought to you by RTC TV4 with Cavalier Basketball. At Co Alliance, we understand the importance of community. After all, we've been farmer owned since the 1920s. And now that we're a part of your community, we want to become your total agronomy solutions provider. Co Alliance offers the latest in ag technology for your operation. From field scouting and fertilizers to premium seed and precision agriculture, we can help take your operation to the next level. Put the resources of your local cooperative to work. Contact CoAlliance today. At Oliver Ford, we reach beyond your dealership expectation, help you in making fun decisions on your new vehicle, or let it try our professional touch by our service and parts department. We are the only Indiana new and used car dealership that has won the President Award 17 times. With over 100 years of sales experience, we're here to hold your hand from start to finish with no pressure or gimmicks. Contact us today. All right, back here at John R. Nelson Gymnasium, sitting on a 4-4 tie with 3.18 left. Cavaliers take a timeout, try to get things in order, inbound pass comes to Braxton Conley. Donovan's going to go ahead and bring the ball to the floor, though. Braxton goes to Manns. Valaquette back over to Conley. You can travel. You have it. Valaquette goes to Ziaj this time. Braxton looking for Donovan, didn't like it. Silva tries to go over top. So a little, just, just a little miscommunication there on where that ball was going to be going there. We got Reinhold and McCarter coming into the game. Isaiah Jackson, has he been in? Oh yeah, he just checked in, he but checked in during the timeout. Nice take there by Stasiak. No foul either way. Looked like clean basketball to me too. I agree with the officials. That'll be two points to Rochester. And they break the tie. Attack. The Silva up top to Conley. Nice pass to Owen. Just a little behind him maybe. Owen hustling Ooh. down. Keeps Good it in bounds. Take by Braxton and the foul. Good job. Good job, all parts there. After a little bit. Oh, God, that they were calling somewhere else the way that Owen was coming down the floor so fast. Again, a little frantic, but Cavaliers managed to keep it under control. Braxton's going to get two chances to Good hustle put some points on the board. Absolutely. Absolutely. It's Isaiah Jackson, if I'm not mistaken. That's the son of, is it Josh Jackson? Former I so, Cavalier? Yeah. yeah. Banks open. Banks open at this hour. Got all four Cavaliers back on the free throw. Interesting. Opening night of basketball, Bank stays open late, state law. Oh, we almost got two of them back in. Going back and set up our defense here. Stasiak goes to the post. Oh, oh looked like a clean pick. Oh, oh it ate a call it clean, okay. Fouls on 15, Reinhold. Deeper foul on number 15, Trent Reinhold. His first team six. I'm missing a foul here for the Zebras somewhere. It's going to be number five, Nicholas Allen. Number 30, Bryce Abbott. For the Cavaliers, number 54, Austin Zayner. 
Austin Zaner makes his varsity debut. Behind the back, it's a to De Silva. Oh, well, he got his pocket picked as well. They come back the other way. Three point bucket for Allen. It's good. Clear out. I'm just trying to tell him. We're one on one here. Giving him the space to get up the floor. Just a little tap. Silva goes to Conley. Richards. Yeah. Might have a foul there. Rochester fans not liking it, but. Foul's on, number four. Foul's on Jackson. Yeah, that'll be one and one. Seven. Yeah. Donovan will check back in the game. Allen makes a move, goes straight to the hoop himself. Oh, he yep. However, that is way too easy for him to yes. get. The hunter's going to have to give him a little bit of space until he, uh, yeah. until he earns some respect from the perimeter. Agreed. A jump stop there, and we're in trouble. Owen Balaquet checks back in the game. Big trap down there in the corner. Hunter directing traffic, trying to handle it. Goes off the leg of a zebra. Back to the Cavaliers, we get a chance to reset here. Hands over to Balaquette, looks up to Braxton. At Austin for a second. That's got the Hunters, three point basket is. Off the front of the rim, also down by Donovan, goes up strong. Oh, I thought we were going to get a and one there, but Donovan will go to the line to shoot two. Yep, I'd like to see the backboard used there. I agree. Fouls number 15, Trent Reinhold, his second. Reinhold picks up his second. Platooning them in yes. for the Zebras. Stampede of zebras onto the floor here. Donovan hits his first, and we'll also have the silver check back in the game for the Cavaliers. See Marquez Anderson in. Two for two for Donovan. For the Cavaliers, number 31, Marquez Anderson, and number 25, Richard De Silva. That, didn't he hit? Okay, there we go. Yeah. Nicholas Allen's played every minute of this first quarter. I think he's the only one for either team to do so. Uh, Donovan may not have come out for the Cavs. Yeah, he did. He did? Yep. Yeah, yeah. So I think this Nick Allen kid for Rochester, he's played every minute of this first quarter. He seems to be kind of their floor general. Takes the center, goes up hard, floats it, and it's good. As time winds down. All right, we'll take a quick timeout with oh. him. Oh, my. Was that in time that that had gone? Yes. Oh, wow. All right, well, we'll take a quick break with him. We're down three, eight to 11. This is Culver TV, brought to you by RTC TV4 with Cavalier Basketball. Want to know what I like best about playing basketball for my high school? I like it because it's a place where my friends get to see me play. I like it because I'm playing for someone besides myself. I'm playing for everybody in my school and every person in my community. Indiana High School Sports. They're more than just a game. Come and see me play.
Hi, I'm John Oliver with a few reasons why your next pre-owned vehicle should be from Oliver Ford Lincoln. Imagine a 172-point certification along with a 44-point safety inspection. We even get you a vehicle history report. It's for your peace of mind because we treat our customers like family. You even get free car washes for life. So get more for your money and more for your trade with certified pre-owned at Oliver Ford Lincoln in Plymouth. All right, back here at the Nelson. Cavs down three on almost tied it up the, the wild shot from the concession stand close things out just off the front of the rim be cavalier ball to kick things off here in the second quarter owen valaquette gonna inbound the donovan ziaja right back to the trap finds donovan inside good position Owen Klinger goes up, 15-footer is off the rim. Get the ball to Allen, he's gonna bring the ball to the floor. Back up top, Stasiak traveled. Traveling violation, Cavalier ball. Trap get Donovan back there again. Can't go over Yuck the top. Hands, yep, not gonna work. <laughs> Always seems like it'll work though. Looking the trap again right there at half court. I get a foul here. Shooting again. Fouls on Blake Hughes. Blake Hughes. His first team, Clinger at the line for the Cavaliers, shooting one and the bonus. Owen Klinger shoot one and one. Bucket's good. Cavaliers, Cavaliers starting off seven to ten from the free throw line. Got to get the ball stopped faster than. Stasiak. What do we have here? Marquez Anderson. Push Foul away from the ball. Yep. Post. Fighting in a post. Not fighting, just jockeying for position. Yeah. Cavalier foul number 31, Marquez Anderson. His first team six. Next shot. Or next free throw, they'll be shooting. Lincoln Felter. Up to Allen. Stasiak shoots a three, and that's good. Three point pass to Quinn Owen scoops to Owen. Donovan's got numbers here now. Puts the brakes on, shoots a 12 footer just off the front of the rim. Down to the corner, Stasiak again. Stasiak, seeing if he can light up. Good rebound. Yeah, you can tell by the way he shoots. If he gets a couple in a row, it's going to be trouble for the Cavaliers. Owen Klinger goes up and puts it in despite getting ridden hard. Good concentration there by Klinger. Owen sitting on two fouls. Yeah, well, watch those hands. Donovan has to play better D than that, though. Well, like you said, I think give Allen some space. If he can chuck on a few of us, then we'll... Okay, that's we'll come another up. Another possession with yep. two offensive rebounds in a row. Lingenfelter gets it. Out we're going Stasiak. Down low. Hughes puts one in. Things start to get away from the Cavaliers here. You get a foul here. I believe that's gonna go on Allen. Nope. Get this on number eleven. Fouls on number Reinerts. 11, Kyle Reinhardt, his second, team's 10. That'll say that Ziyaja to the line for the Cavaliers, shooting two. Still haven't found the two fouls I've missed. I have them at eight fouls, but I'm not going to argue. They were not professionals. No, no. First one is good. Rochester, number three, Grant McCarter, and 
for the Cavaliers, number 15, Braxton Conley. Do we have anybody with two other than Klinger? Hunter. Donovan goes two for two. Free throws keeping us in here. Indeed. McCarter takes it hard, dishes to Allen. Yeah, there you go. Allen cans another, Cavs down six. I get the ball across Good. half court, we do. Brax is gonna kick to Klinger, Klinger, Valaquette. Donovan takes it inside, jump stop, up hard. Ooh, caught one on the elbow, and they're gonna late whistle, but the right whistle. I agree, I, I was gonna say, I don't not, I think it was a little bit of a forced shot, but not one that yeah. still doesn't warrant, warrant that foul being called. Zebra foul on number 32, Blake Hughes, his second. See, at the line for the Cavaliers shooting two. When Donovan had a good strong move to the inside and had positions, so checking in will be Elijah Yarber. One for two for Donovan Ziaja. Carter goes to Lingenfelter. Down in the corner, Allen shoots another three-pointer. In and out, again, not just, no, can't just be in no front, guys. Out, Got a yeah. box out. Can't just out-athlete, guys. Okay, bucket here is huge. Got to get this closed up a little bit. Go! Don's going to take a one-on-one. -on -one. Gets him stumbled up a little bit. Help's coming. Oh, there's a no basket. Oh, man, that's too bad. That was a strong move by Braxton Conley. Just mm -hmm. got that foul in just in time. Braxton doing a good job. He yes. impressed me in uh, soccer, too. Always played hard. Yes. Really yeah. Played with everything he's got. You got to love that about a kid. Absolutely. And not only plays hard, but steps in there with confidence of, of his role in the team and does his best to execute it. Misses his first. We'll have another. Over two. One. Yeah. Stasiak goes to the post. Yarber has him go in and out, but I think that's going to be out of bounds. Yep, good hustle there, but couldn't quite come up with it. Get back to the Zebras. Out of bounds, Cavalier ball. Oh, called Cavalier ball. I thought we were standing on the uh, baseline and tried to grab it. Donovan says don't need it. Going to take him one-on-one. -on -one. Allen's up to the task. So with Jalen King, who's checked into the game. Donovan back out to Klinger. Valakwet down to King. Braxton's going to take it in. He's blocked. That'll be Cavalier ball. We can get our baseline out of bounds in order here. We're going to get a timeout. We'll take it with him. This is Culver TV brought to you by RTC TV4 with Cavalier Basketball. At Co-Alliance Propane, we treat our customers like neighbors because, well, that's what we are. When you trust Co-Alliance Propane as your seriously local propane provider, you're trusting a team of professionals who live, work, and watch the game from right across the county, not the country. A team that's close by and seriously dedicated to your safety and providing the best service possible. Find out more about Co-Alliance Propane's seriously local service and how you can get 50 gallons of propane free at CoAlliancePropane.com. When you 
shop at Oliver Ford Lincoln in Plymouth, you're treated like family, and it's a full-service experience. Our expert service team can keep your vehicle happy for years, from simple maintenance to major repairs. We even provide a loaner car if your vehicle needs to stay overnight, so we have an excellent source of demonstrator vehicles offered to you with substantial discounts. So search our inventory online or stop in for a test drive at Oliver Ford Lincoln in Plymouth. All right, folks, we're back here at Culver Community High School. Pretty much should ride out at a five-point deficit this entire period. I think it started at three, and the Rochester got the first bucket in, and it's been sitting at a five-point lead ever since then. Interesting stat here. Cavaliers have ten free throws to only two field goals. Ball comes in, tapped. Yeah, it did go off of Braxton. It was a good play by Yarber there. Got to tap just enough to get Braxton to flinch for it, and it went off his hands. Trey Stasiak checks into the game for Rochester. Allen brings the ball to the floor. Stasiak centers it, back at the Allen, shoot a long two, but it's good. Kid's a baller. Yeah, indeed. Go long, yeah. Jalen King calling for it. Braxton didn't see it in time. Donovan centers it. Goes behind the back. Klinger down to King. Donovan makes a move, goes up hard. Not enough mustard on it. Tough dribbling the uh, double coverage. Yeah. Lingenfelter takes it in hard. Up top, three-point basket's off. Got to know where the ball's at. Yep, box out, find your man, locate the ball. Lingenfelter misses. Braxton comes up with the rebound. He's going to get it to Donovan. He'll bring the ball to the floor. Got to get it across, guys. Woo, Lordy. Clinger back down to Donovan. And we get an offensive foul there. Oh, Travel. traveled. Yep. Traveling we get Anderson and Manns back in the game. For the Cavaliers, number four, Hunter Manns, and number 31, Marquez Anderson. You get a new zebra on the floor, too. The Guys, they had Jackson, I believe, check back in for Rochester. Three-point basket is good. Grant McCarter knocks one in. Three-point basket, Grant McCarter. All right, Cavaliers going to take a full timeout. We'll take it with them. This is Culver TV brought to you by RTC TV4 with Cavalier Basketball. At Oliver Ford, we reach beyond your dealership expectation, help you in making fun decisions on your new vehicle, or let it try our professional touch by our service and parts department. We are the only Indiana new and used car dealership that has won the President Award 17 times. With over 100 years of sales experience, we're here to hold your hand from start to finish with no pressure or gimmicks. Contact us today. RTC Fiber Communications is proud to announce the new RTC TV4 family of networks. Now you can watch nine local video channels dedicated to covering the events that are important to you from anywhere in the world, 24 hours a day, seven days a week. And you can watch for free. Just download the mobile app, our new Roku channel, or online at www.rtctv4.com. The RTC TV4 family of networks. Start watching today. All right, back here at the Nelson. Coach, I'm just a wrestling coach, but I feel like this is the moment right now. They've got 10 fouls. They're in the double bonus. This is the moment where we have to start really going at them aggressively, picking up fouls, getting to the free throw line, and, and reel this game back in because this is going to get out of hand in a hurry. We don't want to go into halftime, obviously, with any deficit, but the difference between going in down 14, 15, and going down 7 or 8 is huge. Lingenfelder picks up a foul. Still not finding where I missed anything. Donovan will be shooting two. 
It's just what we talked about. Donovan being strong with the ball, picks up the foul. He's going to shoot a couple free throws. First one's good. Mm. One for two. Cavs opting for defense versus going for that offensive rebound. Going to set up, try to force a turnover here. Jackson down low, gets it back out to Allen. Three-point bucket is no good. Again, I think Owen did a good job boxing his guy out, but that was about it. Yeah. And then about three or four other zebras came in to make it hard for him. Good offensive foul here. I'm going back down the other way. Fouls number 12. Trey Stasiak. Offensive foul, so no free throws mm -hmm. will be awarded. I agree. Be aggressive. Step yeah, through be that strong. every now yep. and then. And they got 10 fouls, man. We, they got guys. They've spaced them out. Nobody's in trouble, but there you go, Donovan. Up strong and oh, travel. Dang it. Yep. You did, Donovan. It's just hustle on back, guys. Hustle on back. Jump stop. Go up strong. Let them hack you. Allen walks the ball up. Off Hunter's leg, Jackson runs it down. Does he take it in? No foul. No foul. Go, go. Jalen's going to put on the Jets. He's in jump stop, go up strong. He's blocked, but fouled yet. I thought that was clearer than what we had down there, but we'll take it. Foul to number 24. That's going to Lingenfelter. Lingenfelter, his second. King is alive for the Cavaliers. Jalen King will shoot two. First one rims out. What are we for from the line? The uh, let's see. We're currently 11 for 16. Sorry, 11 for 15. We've only missed four? Yeah. According to my numbers here. Oh, no, sorry, 11 for. Let, let him shoot this, and I'm going to count these up again. Okay. Because I'm trying to keep track of what he hasn't shot and that sort of thing. So let him shoot, and then I'll give you the number. Off the front of the rim here. 11 for 20, so we've cooled quite a bit since our opening run there. Rims in and out. Hey, we got a couple good box outs. Nice job. And come up with a defensive rebound. Pick up another foul here. Get right to the bucket. Got to Make him foul you. Travel there, I Take it in. Take it in, Hunter. Oh, good cut by uh, Owen there. Take it at him. Take it at him. Make him foul. We got we to gotta make hay while the sun's shining here. Dribble. He's all over him. Be strong. Go, go, go. No, don't shoot that. Take it to the hoop. Gosh, dang it. Good defense by Rochester there. Results in a turnover, and they got the chance to balloon this lead back up going into the halftime. Good travel underneath there. No call. Jackson dribbles the ball out. I'll give, it, I'll give credit, though. Abbott was getting... Serious contact, so they might just be letting them just play well, out I mean, in general I'm, there. I'm pretty sure that this is going to, uh, I think this is the uh, game plan tonight is platoon in, play yep. very physical, aggressive defense, make them shoot, make them hit free throws, get a couple fouls on somebody. Yep. They've got a very deep bench, apparently. Three-point bucket is, rims out. Can't have that, can't have that. Guys, we're under five seconds, can't give up offensive rebounds and fouls like that. Maybe that foul's on Marquez. Cavalier foul on number 31, Marquez Anderson. Send Abbott to the line. First one rims out. So we got Stasiak and Reinhold. In for the Zebras and De Silva in for the Cavaliers. This one is good. 
So we're pretty much going to end where we started. Long baseball pass. Tipped. Be out of bounds. Half a second left. And oh, replay, replay, replay. Owen, Owen Balaquet. Oh, my. A good job by Donovan, too, flipping that ball over top right where he could get to it. He flips it up, and that's got plenty of time to splash right on through. Holy cow, Owen Balaquet. What, or Owen, Balaquet. Owen Klinger, what a shot there to end the half. Get the Cavs back. <laughs> I thought let's get back within seven or eight. I wouldn't think about it that way. All right, we'll take a quick, uh, or, uh, sorry, a little lengthier timeout here. Come back with a few minutes left. Cavs down seven. This is Culver TV brought to you by RTC TV4 with Cavalier Basketball. All right, folks, we're back here with you. Um, I just want to first apologize and clarify. I'm not sure which Owen I gave credit to. I might have said I was going back and forth between the names. That was for sure Owen Valaquet who drained that three-pointer there at the end. Got a little excited and just started saying any Owen name I could come up with uh, to spit that out. First half scoring for the uh, Cavaliers. Uh, Valaquet with five, Manns with three, Klinger three, Ziaja six. Conley with one. The Cavs were 11 of 20 from the free throw line, and that was after starting, I think, something like 10 of 14 or something. They, they really kind of tapered off after a strong start. Zebras, uh, Quinn Stasiak, five. McCarter, three. Allen, 10. Reinerts, one. Lingenfelter, three. Abbott, one. Hughes, two. Zebras are two of eight from the free throw line. To start this off, I believe it'll be Zebra basketball to start the third period. Cavaliers 18, Zebras 25. See what we have in store for the second half. Allen brings the ball to the floor, guarded by Manns. Stop. Out of the lane and Felter. Stasiak in the lane, goes up and rims out. Nice rebound by Braxton. Pushes it up ahead to Donovan. Donovan going to clear the floor, get it over to Hunter. Down in the corner to Klinger. Donovan takes it inside, jump stop, up strong. Comes out, I think maybe expecting a foul there. Up strong again, there he gets the foul. He'll shoot two. Foul goes against Quinn Stasiak. First one's up and good for Donovan. That second's up and good. Score stop score here. Indeed. Right back to that five point lead we sat on for most of the second period. Allen goes down low, and Bucket's good. And he's hard to handle. Yep. Blake Hughes at the bucket. Foul on number 15, Braxton Conley. Yeah. Okay. Looks like he called 25. They're going Braxton Conley here. His first team's first. Hughes looks to complete the three-point play. Up and good. Clinger gets it over to Valaquet. Up ahead to Donovan. Attack. We got a three on one here. Braxton's scrapping for it. Comes up with it. Looks for help in the corner. Oh, wow. Good, good hands there. Ryan did a good job of batting that down and scooping it up at the same time. Hughes kicks it out. Get him out of the way. Allen up top to Stasiak. 20 seconds. Allen's looking inside. Missed reverse layup. Donovan comes up with the rebound. Valaquet centers it. 
trap over there and bounce it off the Zebras. Cavaliers will get a side out of bounds play here. All right, let's see offense gets set. Attacks and dishes. Klinger back up top to Valaquette. Donovan comes up top to Braxton. Oh, he got a yep. nope, did not get away with it. Yeah, he knew it as soon. I think almost like if he hadn't made the face, he might have might have gotten away with it. Entering the game for caller number 20, Jalen Jalen King. King checks back in to give Braxton a little break here. Allen brings the ball across the floor. Stasiak down low to Hughes, who goes up strong and good. That's it, number 32, Blake Hughes. <clears throat> Flinger up to King. On our man, gets a down low to Donovan. Donovan's going to go ahead and take it himself, up strong. Again, kind of foul anticipating there. Got to be a little, a little more firm with the basketball. Hughes again, and he'll get fouled. Jalen with just a little gentle, yeah. gentle shove there. Hughes dominating the second half. Yeah, no kidding. Found, they figured out a way to get it to him down there. Jalen picks up his first. And we'll shoot. We'll get two free throws here from Hughes. First one rims out. Austin Zayner checks in the game. Second one's good. Zebras by 11. A little push there. Get that foul be on Stasiak. McCarter getting ready to come in for the Zebras. Officials conferring here. He was trying to call a foul on 24, it looked like, but I don't know that he was anywhere near the play. Is going to be on Quinn Stasiak. Number two, Quinn Stasiak. Carter in the game here now. Right, backs it out. Dylan's going to pass back to Hunter. Crosses the middle. Austin back out to Donovan, shoots a three-pointer. Rims out. Zebras on the run here. Donovan goes with the swipe, misses. Hughes puts another one in. He's up to eight points this quarter. Down low to Zayner. Klinger crosses over to King. Donovan gets it to Hunter, back down to Zayner. Takes it himself, off the front of the rim. Rebound to Lingenfelter, who'll bring it up himself. Back to Lingenfelter, centers it. We'll get a foul on Owen Klinger this time. Foul for number 10, Owen Klinger. Three on him. We'll see Owen Valaquette back in the game. We're going to take a timeout. We'll take it with him. This is Culver TV, brought to you by RTC TV4 with Cavalier Basketball.
Oliver Ford is the largest certified pre-owned dealer in Michiana. Our inventory changes daily and you are guaranteed the best customer service in our area. We treat you like family. Every certified pre-owned Ford includes factory-backed warranty coverage, complimentary vehicle history report and lots more. Don't miss out on our end-of-year discounts on all of our good-as-new inventory. Rates low as we have ever seen and the best customer service you have ever experienced. All right, back here at John R. Nelson Gymnasium. Your Cavaliers down 13, Rochester with the ball. Starting to just ooze away from the Cavaliers here. We're going to get this back under control. We've got about 422 left. Got to have a couple stops, a couple buckets, and get this thing back at the striking distance for the, third, for the fourth period. Hughes rims out. Zaner comes up with the rebound, gets it to Ziaja. He's going to bring the ball to the floor himself. On her back down to Ziaja. And back down, back down. And we get an offensive foul there. Yep. I don't know. Long and Lingenfelter did a good job baiting him right into that yeah. one. Well, I mean, technically, a couple of year, years ago, they did illegalize the uh, backing down. So I, I think he got away with two or three displacements. Mm -hmm. And then that yep. last one, Lingenfelter did a good job of falling to the floor. Yep. Good job, Hunter. Dahman right up in his face. Nice defense. Thing felt throughout to Allen. Short jumper's no good. Xander comes up with the rebound. Hunter Mann's going to bring the ball to the floor. Austin Zaner, a couple of rebounds. Yeah, absolutely. Doing work in there. Skips it across. A little more movement here. A little more movement from the Cavs. Going for some swipes. Balcud goes down to Austin. Austin, nice pass to Hunter. He'll shoot two, but that was a great look from Austin Zayner there. Nice take by Hunter Manns, and we'll get a chance at a couple free throws. Foul's going to go against Lingenfelter. That'll be his third. To get Abbott and Jackson checked back in the game. I believe that's Yarber, isn't it? Is it Yarber? So 40, not a 30. Yep, it is. Good call, Coach. You get Trey Stasiak in the game as well. Keep, zebra's keeping them fresh legs in there. Absolutely. Again, Cavs with this uh, strategy of just going ahead and get back on defense after the free throw. Gives them a chance, I guess, to talk things out and organize what they want to do. Yeah, must and when be Hunter a, hits two, that'll work out real well. Statistical move or yeah, something. Yeah, absolutely. I've seen that happen some at the pro level. Aziak. Jackson goes over to Carter, who takes it in. Stasiak's going to go up top. Got away with the travel there. Gets his own Another rebound, puts it in. Rebound. Reinert puts it in. Austin takes the 15 footer off the front of the rim. Zebras are moving down the floor again. Maybe travel again there. No call. Donovan Ziaja bring the ball to the floor. Got to finish this quarter strong these Indeed. last two minutes, being striking distance. Austin gets it to Valaquette. Here, Coach Yellen, movement, movement. Balakot has the ball at top. Looks for Donovan. Again, kind of floats one. I think I'd like to see him go up a little stronger than that. Ooh. Austin forces the jump ball there. Go ahead and stay here. Jump ball. I think Don's just changing his shot on those drives. He needs yeah. not to change his shot. Just I agree. Go up. He, he, he's, the referee's approved, and they'll blow the whistle for him if he yeah. owns the space. 
Austin brings it back up top to Donovan. Counts on here. Nice pass. Austin's going to get a look. And rattles one in. Austin Zayner puts one on the board. Down low. Nice defensive help from Owen Valaquet there. Here we go. Jalen King take it in. Up nice strong. Reverse. Oh. oh, man. Good hustle back, though. Yeah, absolutely. What you like to see when yeah. the mistake's made. Just like that, back out to 13 again. That's a four-point swing there. Instead of being down nine, we're down 13. Owen Valakwa thought about it. Decided not to. Gonna bring the ball back out. Gonna slow things down here, maybe hold for one shot. Clock takes down to 15. Zebras come up. Cavaliers engage. Austin back up top to Donovan. Just under 10 seconds left. Donovan's going to take it in. Out to Austin. Donovan breaks the center. we got three seconds left. Hmm. Not what we wanted out of that offensive possession. Cavs down 13 going into the final period. We'll take a quick break. This is Culver TV. Brought to you by RTC TV4 with Cavalier Basketball. Enjoy full screen television viewing of the new RTC TV4 family of networks anywhere you are with our new Roku channel. Simply purchase a Roku device from RTC or any Roku retailer, connect to your in-home Wi-Fi, then download the RTC TV4 channel. It's that easy. Watch all of our live channels 24-7 for free or subscribe to view all of our videos at your convenience. The RTC TV4 channel on Roku, another great service from RTC. I don't think of this as a high school weight room. It's more like a high school classroom. I'm learning how to manage my time here. I'm learning that it's important to have goals and that it takes persistence and commitment to reach them. And I'm learning that the best way to lead is by example. Indiana High School Sports. They're more than just a game. Come and see me play. <laughs> All right, folks, back here at Culver Community High School. It's just been kind of a slow bleed here. The Cavs haven't gotten significantly outplayed at any portion of the game, but at the moments that the Zebras could just kind of push that needle out on their lead a little bit, they have, and the Cavs haven't been able to get that back. It's, it was, what was it, I think four or five, it was three after first period, eight or seven after halftime, and now 13 after three quarters, and it's just, like I said, it's just been kind of a slow, methodical push out of that lead. Not sure what uh, Coach Hafley. Ah, another offensive rebound. I'm not sure what Hafley's thoughts on this are, but the Owens do have the ability to light it up from beyond the arc if it comes to that late in the game. And Hunter Mans. That's true. The purest shooter on the team. That's true. I forget about Hunter being, being a long range bomber himself. Oh. Pass handled by Marcellus Anderson over there. Unfortunately, he's no longer wearing the orange and black, so that'll be an out of bounds. Back to the Zebras. Zebras more than patient here on offense. Happy to wait for the best shot possible. Right at the Cav logo, runs in and out. Nice box out by Hunter Manns. He's going to bring the ball to the floor himself. A minute gone already, though. Cavs still down 13. Klinger makes a move. Out to Zayner. Thought about it, doesn't like it. Balak could take it in. Bout out to Hunter. Top to Donovan. Up fake. He's the Cav logo. Ball tipped and popped, and Zebras ran at the floor. Blocked by Jalen King. He's got it himself, and he's going to charge. He's got Owen up ahead of him. He's going to take it himself. And we'll pick up the foul. That'll do right there. He's going to shoot two. Picks up a shooting foul even. Nice work, Jalen King. 
Bryce Abbott picks up his first. So now every single zebra except Grant McCarter has picked up a foul in this game. So again, <laughs> using those, spreading them out. Nobody in serious foul trouble either. So they're really, really using their their pressure and their fouls and their aggressive play effectively. Jalen King drains his first. Nicholas Allen checks back in the game, as does Owen Klinger. Jalen's second free throw is off. Zebras bring the ball to the floor. Allen goes down low to Hughes. Jackson back up top to Allen. Travel. Like Jackson looks down low to Hughes. Oh. Bucket's good. That's tough Bucket's to stop right there. What you can do about that. You got a 6'5 guy who can hit a jump shot like that. Uh, that's tough to do. Ball tapped, but recovered by Owen. No, his whole body's got to go over. Crowd was wanting an over and back. That's right. We can let him get worked up. That's going to end up going back to the Zebras anyway. Pressure getting to the Cavaliers here. Again, that lead just that pushing that needle out. They're out 14 now with the ball. Culver's really needing to stop here. Jackson goes down low to Abbott. Kicks out. Allen patient. Abbott shoots a long two. Rims out. No box out. Can't just chase it, guys. Rims out again. Jalen comes up with the ball. Hunter Manns gets it across the timeline. Oh, wow. Not sure what happened there. Lost the handle on it or what? Jackson goes up, gets fouled, he'll shoot two. Fouls on Austin Zayner, that'll be his first personal. Fifth team foul. First free throw is no good. We'll check Braxton Conley and Donovan Ziaja in the game for the Cavaliers. Second free throw is good. Jalen King has it stripped. Allen's blocked, but they're going to get a foul there on Owen Klinger. Cavalier foul number 10, Owen Klinger. It's his fourth. His fourth. At this point, though, with down 15, I let, we're going to have keep rotation normal. If this is a eight-point lead, I might feel differently, but... I think coach is going to let him play it out, and I don't disagree with that. First one rims out. I check Stasiak and Lingenfelter back in the game. Second one's good. Entering the game for the Cavaliers, number four, Hunter Mann. Hunter Mann does go ahead and check in for Owen Klinger there. Zebras keep them with their pressure, up 16. Ball go back to the Cavs. Owen gets it into Hunter. Again, tapped away again. Easy bucket there for Lingenfelder. Cavs will take a full timeout. We'll take it with them. This is Culver TV brought to you by RTC TV4 with Cavalier Basketball. The RTC TV4 family of networks allows you to watch nine local television channels dedicated to coverage of our schools and our communities directly on your mobile device through our new app. 
Just look up RTC TV4 at the App Store or the Google Play Store. There is no cost to download the app or cost to view the live channels. With a paid subscription, you can also view any of our past videos on demand whenever you want. Download the app today and start watching. All right, back here at John R. Nelson Gymnasium. Things have just about gotten out of hand for your Cavaliers. And barring some sort of a serious onslaught of three-pointers or something, this is going to be a rough one to come back from. Five minutes left, down 18. Still having a hard time with the pressure that the Zebras are bringing, particularly when they go into their trapping defense. One positive note, though, Cavaliers really did some work at the free throw line tonight. Donovan Ziaja has eight points, all of which were at the free throw line. Zebras jump out the trap again. Donovan at the Cav logo, out to Braxton. Braxton goes up, rims off. Again, another one where it kind of looked like he was maybe expecting a foul there. We gotta go up strong. Ball's gonna stay here. Yep, just gotta get in the habit of not putting the ball on the floor yep. automatically. Bounce pass to Donovan, top to Jalen, shoots the 18-footer off the front of the rim. Zebras collect, four and a half left. A clear out foul there, he didn't call, call that on Hunter, I think. Be Hunter's third. Zebras are shooting one and one. Nicholas Allen at the line, shooting one in the bonus. Allen will shoot free throw here. Brims out, rebound Hughes. Basket in the foul. He's kind of been the story the second half. Blake Hughes done a great job. Conley picks up the foul. Free throw is good. Oh, right between the hands, right between the legs. Go back to the zebra ball. Down in the corner. Lingenfelter up top to Stasiak. Reinhardt's back out to Lingenfelter. Long two is good. Those points will be credited to Kyle Reinhardt. Conley gets the ball to the top, goes down to Owen Balaquet. Ball tapped out of bounds. Stays here. Owen gets over the top. Hunter's going to be able to run that one down, I think. Offense sets up. Balaquet, back up the King, pop fake. Hunter looks for screen, doesn't want it, goes back to it. Gets the handle back. Donovan gets in strong, doesn't like it. Back out to Balaquet. About three minutes left here. Donovan goes up. He'll pick up a foul. 
shoot two. Foul is going to go against Kyle Reinerts. Bond is good on the first. Reinhold checks in for the Zebras. And Klinger in for the Cavs. So we're going to get Trey Stasiak. And Bryce Abbott in for the Zebras. Second free throw is good. Stasiak centers. Goes up top to Allen. Allen drives in. Pump fakes. Blocked by King. Into the corner for Conley. Clingers in a shoot. Off the rim. Mm. Yep. A little bit out of control there, yeah. He's shooting two. He's shooting Cavalier one and one, really. Check Grant McCarter into the game here as soon as we get a chance. Now. If Grant McCarter picks up a foul in the next 229, that'll mean every single Zebra on, on their roster right now will have picked up at least one foul in this game. I don't think I've ever before seen that. Hmm. So I think that's kind of part of the game plan. Yeah. First one's up and good. He'll get another. Rims out. Jalen comes up with the rebound. Jalen over to Braxton. Donovan looking for help. Finds Owen Valaquet. Owen Klinger back up to Braxton. Two minutes left in this contest. Cavs down 22. Pass fake by Donovan. Back up to Braxton. Off the foot. Recovers. Well, Balakwa takes one in himself. Up strong. He's going to shoot two. Shots up and good. Isaiah Jackson checks back in for the Zebras. So how many of these 28 points have we scored on free throws? Um, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Amazing. 18. 18. We have four field goals this game. Ball is stolen. Cavs continue to play right down to the end. Like to see that. Old Balco out of the Jalen King. Donovan gets it up top to Owen Klinger. Donovan takes it himself. Puts one in. We'll get a timeout here with exactly 60 seconds remaining in this game. We'll take it with them. This is Call for TV, brought to you by RTC TV4 with Cavalier Basketball. At Co-Alliance, we understand the importance of community. 
After all, we've been farmer-owned since the 1920s. And now that we're a part of your community, we want to become your Total Agronomy Solutions Provider. CoAlliance offers the latest in ag technology for your operation. From field scouting and fertilizers to premium seed and precision agriculture, we can help take your operation to the next level. Put the resources of your local cooperative to work. Contact CoAlliance today. Alright, back here at the Nelson. One minute left. Cavs down 18. Going to get a JV switch out here. Some of these youngsters a chance to get some run here on the varsity stage. Not much doing in that guard for Rochester as they go deep into their bench and use every single possible player. So good exposure here for our JV players to get a look at some varsity action. See Josh Havron, Dalton Powell on the floor for the first time tonight. Kind of way he wants to travel there. I'm guessing the referees are going to let some stuff yep. slide. I think that's three blocks for Jalen King tonight, so that's nice to see. Yep. But I think you know how I feel about block shots. Unless you're seven foot tall. Yep, yep. Because they still retain possession there. And then picked up a foul, and now they're going to shoot two free throws. Yep. When you leave your feet, you're not in a position to box out and right. get a rebound. Yep. But very Good. athletic and very pleased with the way Jalen's played tonight. Yeah. I, th I think he's totally played within himself. Shown some great hustle. Super athletic. Works Absolutely. hard in the weight room. And don't... Uh, I, I will, I will Rochester, contrast yours with don't. Now we're down 18, but if this is a two-point game, and you get that. Don't don't discount the emotional factor of seeing your teammate's shot chucked into the 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 back uh, backstop there. Yeah, but I feel I'm I'm okay with it because it's our ball out of bounds. If it happens, mm -hmm. I, you know. That's exactly what Abbott does. Yeah. Nice he is hustle. a scrapper. Yep. I'll, I'll give credit to Rochester in general. That's pretty much how they have done this entire 20-point lead. They've, If you can scrap out a 20-point blowout win, that, that's exactly what they did tonight. All right, that'll do it for the season opener. Uh, Rochester wins the annual pre-Thanksgiving game by 20. On behalf of Colt Miller and Chris Stevens, we'd like to thank you for your viewing of tonight's game. This has been... Culver TV, brought to you by RTC TV4 with Cavalier Basketball.